is Lincoln Higa. I would like to share with you my replica of the Santa Cruz mission. I decided to build it in Minecraft. I will also share some real pictures from there. The Santa Cruz mission was the 12th mission to be built in California. It was founded by Father Furman Blausian on September 25, 1791. Mission Santa Cruz comes from the meaning Holy Cross Mission. A lot of the original mission was destroyed by earthquakes and floods here, which is why it was known as the Hard Luck Mission. It was later restored in November 1931. The replica is only one third the size it was before it was destroyed. The mission was built out of adobe brick stone. It was native to the Olo and Yogurt Indians. They went there to work and go to church. They produced grain, corn, beans. They, they had the least amount of livestock at this mission, but they did raise cattle and sheep. The original mission was extended all the way to a nearby the pa the Pajaro River nearby that was used as their water source. Here was a is a tour of the garden area. This is where they planted all their fruits and vegetables. This fountain here is what they used to wash their clothes. Clothes. A statue of Father Sarah who led the missions systems mission systems and a statue of the father Wilson can be found in the garden. There is also a statue of the Virgin Mary here in the garden. There, they also gathered here for celebrations. The part of the mission is the warehouse where the workers made things like leather, adobe bricks, and other stuff. They worked hard every day. Here's the real picture. Here's the real. Here is the real picture of what looked like inside of the warehouse and their sleeping areas. And this is what it looks like today as a gift shop where they have different artifacts like original paintings, a chalice, chalice used to be a price and tunes and tools where they what they that they used. And inside these stores in their church is their church. These are the areas where they sit. This is where they light candles when they are about to pray. Over here is holy water to bless everyone that went in. And up here is the balcony for the priest would read the Bible. These are the statues of the Virgin Mary. 
This is the balcony for the choir. These are the bell towers up here. These were rung multiple times each day to, to tell everyone it was time for church. Dinner or even to alert the Native Americans of, of the task that needed to be done next. In 1796, the population was more than 500. There was a problem with the mission being close to early settlers. The governor ignored the request from the priest having large space, a large space between towns and missions and started building his own town for settlers. For the settlers. Most of the settlers were criminals and that didn't want to run farms. Instead, they stole things from the natives. The natives started to leave and the popular and the population grew smaller by 1797. By 1800, a lot of the remaining natives died from diseases like the flu, scarlet fever, and measles. More of them tried to run away because of these diseases and their, cruel, and their cruel treatment by settlers. And even the, some priests who punished them for trying to run away. By 1834, Mexico gained independence from Spain, but couldn't afford to keep running the missions. Eventually, property was divided and sold off. Mission Santa Cruz was the first to be secularized. Mission Santa Cruz is the smallest of all missions, but the museum, the garden, and the church is still worth a nice, vi a nice little visit. It still continues to serve as a Catholic church today.